Hi, Lee Ankrum here from the Ankrum Institute. Let's talk about having a hysterectomy, just one aspect of it, because there's many things that happen besides hormonally, besides you know having some part of your body taken out. Your uterus is located in the center between my pubic bones and my sacrum. So your bladder comes first, urinary bladder, the uterus is in the center, and your bowel is behind. So it's almost like a little sandwich here. They're ligamented together. What also happens is, is that my small intestines are located above my uterus, here, in front of the lumbar spine, as I've told before on these Facebook posts. When the uterus is taken out, two things happen. One is the urinary bladder gets unstable, and so does the, so does the mesentery. It quite often drops down into the space where the uterus was. It drops. Either of these things happening, the bladder actually losing its stability and the mesentery will oftentimes create tension in the fascia that actually goes down from the pelvic floor and down the inner leg. We see that quite often. You can have somebody who is knocked kneed or you can have pronation in the foot. You see that really commonly when the pressures and the tensions change in the pelvic area. But this is a big one. Uterus comes out, intestines can fall, you get tightness down the legs. Besides the, besides the workings of the intestines themselves change. Thank you very much.